Locating and removing large files is a great way to free up hard drive space on your Windows 8 operating system. While this may actually not give you a huge performance increase, it at least make your usability of the operating system a lot better. There are a lot of tools out there who can help you with this, and I'm going to be using one today that we've used previously in this video series known as Glare Utilities. If you don't have Glare Utilities, notice I have the free download section at my website, pcmtechhelp.com. If you highlight over it, it's going to give you a drop down. And you're going to scroll down to System Tuning. And System Tuning has a subsection known as Cleaning and Tuning. And then there's four tools here I have located in the Cleaning and Tuning section. And we are interested in Glary Utilities. Now make sure you've downloaded the latest version of this, which is actually version 3. Earlier in this video series, we used version 2.8. And it actually does not have this utility uh, built into it. Once you've downloaded and installed it, we're going to launch it however way you wish. You can either launch it from your desktop. I'm going to go ahead and use my start menu that I installed earlier in the series. And I'm going to go to Programs, and I'm going to launch Glary Utilities 3. Once Glary Utilities boots up, we have three options here. We can do the basic overview of your system. You can do one-click maintenance, which is still in this version of Glary Utilities. But we're interested in the Advanced Tools section, which will give us a great tool for disk management. So let's go to Disk Space, and at the very bottom there's an option called Explorer Disks. Once the drive selection comes up, just select the drive you want to scan to remove the large files from, and select OK. Once the scan is complete, you'll see a complete breakdown of your actual drive that you selected, and it'll be organized by the size of that drive. At this point, we can actually double click on whichever object we want to, including folders, and it'll actually give us a breakdown of that folder into what size each folder is, so we can actually locate the largest files on our system and see if they're still relevant or useful to us. Now remember, you don't want to just go in here and delete anything that's large. You want to make absolutely sure that your system doesn't require that. So typically, this is a great way to remove large video files, large temporary files, or large files that you may have worked with a long time ago and you just don't use them anymore. So always make sure you know what the file is before you delete it. And if you have any questions, feel free to stop by the PCM Tech Help Show community at Google+. Plus and that's at pcmtechhelp.com forward slash community. And if you have additional questions, you can always Google it. That's usually what I do. So that's how you remove large files from your hard disk. And that is it for this video.